No, actually I don't. Ah, I'm surprised because uh, I find normally Camtasia the files are quite large. Yeah, it's really large, but you know, it's okay, you know, it's not taking too long. I have 100 megabytes internet connection. <laughs> uh, <laughs> awesome. Wow. Yeah. 100 Mbps? Yeah. That's really fast. Yeah, that's fast. Uh, okay, anyway, but it's splitting between three or four computers here. So, you know, I just divided equally to all of them. So it's still pretty quiet. Pretty, pretty fast. Right. Uh, okay. So on today's session, we're going to cover how to open new uh, uh, Amazon listing. I will speak about two types of listing, but we only going listing. But we are going. We are going only to cover one, okay? Cover one type. Um, sorry. Type. Uh, another thing. Wait a second. Okay, I'm not sure what happened, but it's okay so the next thing we're going to cover is um, how uh, to create barcode from our listing which is like two seconds from uh, uh, from out of our listing another thing I will get you a video sorry listing okay how to pick the right keywords and description for your products oh sorry I'm not sure oh it's kind of wait a second okay how to pick the right uh, keywords and description and title title for your product okay that's the fundamentals and images okay uh, how important they are how important they are um, one more thing uh, I will try to cover today you know let's start from this and I see if I'll get to to the Facebook training uh, maximum I'll do it on Friday okay so uh, I have approximately one hour before I go into a restaurant with my wife, you know, her, her friend has a birthday today and, you know, we're kind of celebrating to her. So I'll try to, to do it, yeah. Uh, wait a second. Uh, okay. Great. So, on to those, uh, let me just uh, log into my Seller Central account. Real quick. Uh, let me just make sure that it's recording yeah it's recording okay and let me just log into my account real quick okay so <clears throat> on uh, my okay first of all I want you to do it with me guys okay all of you yep. so uh, I want you to log in all all of you to your account and do step by step what I'm going to do right now okay Okay, so first of all, let's, uh, let's just practice on one of you guys' products, okay? Uh, so who's want, wanted to be his product? 
So let me just uh, let's take uh, I don't know maybe maybe Frank's product as uh, as a reference, so we can uh, or maybe let's take Yvonne's product since Yvonne is much uh, you know it's it's kind of our formula product you know she and uh, and uh, also uh, I think it's Chuan that them um, made. Uh, made our uh, the, the product exactly like we 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 suggested to so Yvonne, Yvonne uh, would you like would you like us to uh, to do the practice on your product sorry I'm, I'm on a new laptop are we on team viewer right now I'm catching up oh I'm sorry I, I will just practice opening new listing about your product uh -huh. I will open okay. new product on my account like your product, uh -huh. but I will delete it, delete it uh, later on. I just want to show you okay. how to do that. Okay. Uh, sorry, but I, I can't see your screen. Are we on Team Vivo right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are. Would you like me? To He's sharing his uh, screen via Skype, I think. Oh, right this is like yeah. I can't see anything on Skype. Okay, so let me just share with you my team viewer uh, username and ID. Okay, wait a second, Yvonne. Uh huh. This one and this one. Uh, okay, that's my username and password. Okay, give me a minute. Uh, okay. okay, because I'm. I'm using this new laptop and I'm trying to figure it out as well. For, uh, how do I go into this? Uh, uh, sorry, I I can't go in. Okay, um, let me see. You cannot see my screen yet? No. Okay, I see your away. That is very different. Okay, I can see your in. I can see your in. And you will probably see my screen in a few seconds. With this new laptop. Uh, okay, don't don't worry, don't worry, one. I know, I know it's like this. <laughs> it's always when you have like a new computer. No, I, mean, I insist it's going to be you, <laughs> because let me just huh? try. Let me try to to call you and try to call you back again. What do you say about that? I just try to call you all of you guys again because I want to pick Yvonne's product and show you how I'm. Because Yvonne is kind of an interesting product because it has a lot of elements inside and it's good product to practice. I will explain to you okay. more why Yvonne's product is really. It's really a good product to practice on because it, it kind of uh, contains many elements and that's the, the, the part that I want to um, kind of uh, focus on on Yvonne's product. It's a good product to practice. Okay? I, I tell you what, I'm going to change to another laptop. So I, I'll join the call in a short while. Uh, yeah, let me let me try to call you all of you guys right back. Okay, I will try to hang up this call and call you call you all back. Okay, bye bye. Okay. Wait, one second. Bye. One second. Bye. Okay, guys, who can hear yes. me? Yeah, I can hear you. I can see your screen. Okay, great. Okay, Sean, can you see my screen? 
Uh, what's on your screen? Is it just Skype? Yeah, it's Skype. Uh, it, it you see all faces and now you can see Amazon can you see Amazon yes okay yes. Yvonne are you there Yvonne okay. Martin I can hear you Hello. yeah great okay can you see my screen okay. <clears throat> Martin yeah. Yeah, okay, great. And uh, where is Yvonne? <laughs> and she suddenly disappeared. Uh, okay. Um, sorry? Yeah. I have a question. Sure, Martin. Yeah. Uh, remember the pinking shirts? Yeah. I go back and take a look at the rankings of um, uh, those products. Okay. It seems that the BSLs is becoming uh, not that good. It happens to like quite a number of products, so I don't know what happened. I I know, I know. it's it happened to many products. You know, it's not something that uh, you know, especially if it's seasonal product. Your product is not kind of seasonal, but it has a lot of his graph is like sometimes. You no, know, let let me show you his graph is like uh, a. Uh, as, uh, a jigsaw. Let me show you. Uh, uh, okay. So it's still good to go after that product. Yeah, because uh, one month is 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 on 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 high peaks, and one month is on lower peaks. But if you are doing the promotion well, then you can expect it to be always on the high position. Okay. Okay. Mm. Just a quick. Uh, if you, if you are asking me, it's a great product. Okay, that I strongly advise you to go for it. Okay. Okay. I have another product. I don't know uh, what you think about it. Okay. Uh, travel pillow. Travel. Travel pillow. Travel pillow. Oh, I know about this product. I was trying to get this product once. Uh, <laughs> to be honest, uh, the competition is too hard, it's too hard for this product, and the price are too low. No, I'm not, I'm not advising you to. It's the, the like the half cycle product, right? The half cycle pillow, right? But the reviews are uh, lesser than 800, and the price is around 20 plus dollars. Yeah, I know. No, it's not 100. It depends on what type of pillow you're going to buy. But you know, the best sellers are currently, you know, like a very simple, stupid, simple pillows you know it's not like a, a good pillows I can uh, you know I can expand on it more actually this product is um, it's going to be really hard to compete with you know that's what I'm going okay. that's what I have to say about it I was trying to get this product once and the competition became too hard for this product and there are, there are many, many things to take into account. If it's a memory foam pillow, if it's like, uh, you know, there is a lot of things to consider when you're taking this product. So please, 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 you know, uh, you know, you can take this product. Anyway, it has the whole the element. You see, some of them are hard to compete. Uh, but some of them are, you know, really not, not that uh, good, you know. I don't know if I'm advising you to go for this product. You see here the competition is too hard and here the competition is too hard. You know, there is like 744, there is like uh, 90, not 95, it was 901 and uh, 1,045, it's a lot, you know. Okay. Uh, not really advising you to go for it. I was trying to go for it and then I just uh, <coughs> drop it. Okay? So, okay. Uh, Yvonne, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Uh, can you see my screen? Yes, I can. Okay, great, great. Okay, fantastic. So, let me just uh, stop you all guys mouse because it's hard for me to control my computer when you're moving your mouse. <laughs> Okay, 
So anyway, Yvonne, your product is the one who I chose to take into uh, into uh, my my exam my example. So first of all, the the first thing you need to do is just type sewing kit. You know, uh, sewing kit. I mean your main keywords product sewing kit, which uh, Yvonne's main keywords product is sewing kit, right, Yvonne? Yvonne. Okay, great. You can keep it not on mute. Okay. Uh, okay. So your your best keyword is suing it. So I, I uh, so first of all, first thing you need to do is keyword the search bar, and then I suggest you. Let me just uh, close some windows. This wait a second. Uh, this one I'm going to minor, and this one I'm going to quit, 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 and let's just take it to the left okay uh, and then you need to go to all the 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 best product the five best product on your uh, on your niche on your on your main keyword okay that's the second thing thing exactly like you're doing research okay so next thing you're going to do is you're going to see what is the best um, the best uh, 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 niche for your product for example this best niche for this product currently is art craft and sewing let me see other product let me just take the other product and see this one is art craft and sewing okay and let's take other product it's art craft and sewing and this product for example it's art craft and sewing and this product it's art craft and sewing okay so i'm <clears throat> definitely sure that i'm going to uh, place my product under art craft and sewing okay uh but let's just take another example just uh, to show you like a, a little bit difficult product uh any any suggestion let's take the picnic picnic blanket okay for example okay that's the picnic blanket and let's take some of the five best seller on this niche you know like the five best products on this niche and let me show you one thing okay so first of all that's the the first one and i see it's located on position 770 which is very good position and it's on baby okay second thing second product let me go okay and here I can see that this one is 2082 and it's on automotive. Okay, let's continue. This one on 49 on automotive. Okay, let's continue. This one is on, let's see the niche. Wait a second. I hope you can see, you can all guys see my screen. Okay, this on closing and it's uh, ranked really nice. Okay. Can you see my screen? Uh, it's just it's lo loading for me. Oh. It's got a white background. Okay. And uh, yeah, the last one is on patio, lawn, and garden, and it's 2000, 2011. Uh, that means that the best niche for this product is automotive. Why it's automotive? Because the best rank, best seller rank product, which is the right 49 here it's an automotive that's what i want to pick for my product that's the niche i want to pick for my product okay okay so in in yvonne's case it's uh, it's not automotive uh, it's uh, it's a uh, craft and uh, something like this it was craft sewing and craft let's go back to yvonne's product okay it's uh, arts craft and sewing okay so what you need to do what you need to do right now is go to inventory and here you need to pick add a, a, add a product okay so i want you all guys to add a new product okay so please go ahead and click on add a product on your uh, uh computer and and do that okay sorry uh basically the criteria that uh we, we are supposed to pick is um, 
the same criteria as the uh, product but, with the BS, the, the best BSR. Yeah, right? exactly, exactly. You got my point. You want to imitate the BSR. You want to re to recreate the success. Okay, that's why I'm telling you that. That's tips okay. that no one is going to tell you. You know, uh, it's 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 the the most crucial thing to to imitate your pro your your the best the best seller. Okay. All right. Uh, and uh, now, uh, every, is er, everyone on Ed product screen? Yes. Yes. Okay. Now you need to create on create a new product. Click on create a new product. Okay. Okay. All right. And now you you need to put your main keyword sewing kit. Okay. Yvonne's product is sewing kit. Okay. So, and click on find category. Okay. Okay, so here you need to f to to uh, uh, pick the right niche as long as it's it's on your criteria. What I mean, it's on your criteria. It's on uh, art and sewing craft or automotive. Depends on what's the main niche. But for Yvonne's, it's going to be sewing kit. So sewing tool repair kit. That's the right one for Yvonne. Okay. Yvonne, make sense? Uh, uh, Ori, I, I typed picnic blankets, but how come I'm not seeing um, automotive? Okay, sometimes it happens. Let's let's do it. Uh, let let me do that. Picnic, picnic blanket. Oh. I yeah. think automotive is a restricted category. Yeah, you need to. Sorry, blanket. Uh, you need some time to uh, open uh, a ticket on on the support. Let me just uh, let me let me explain it to you. You know, I, I just uh, I need to explain it to you before. But you know, there is like a, you need to when when sometimes uh, a category is restricted, you need to go here to help. Okay, sorry. Let me just show you how how to do that. You need to go here to help, and then. Uh, you need to click on help really click on help actually okay and contact seller support okay that's what you need to do and and, right. and tell them uh, you need to say that you are selling on Amazon actually and um, you need to um, actually it's a product and inventory okay issue listing a product okay you need to click on issue and uh travel adding viewing a product no 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 uh that's category it's product category you can just type on product category let me just try to do that you know I'm okay category product listing restrictions okay you need to click on listing restriction and uh, you need to category requesting approval. You see here, category, re re uh, and and then you need to go to, uh, for example, automotive. Let me just go to automotive, automotive, and view requirements. But you don't really need to view requirements. You you just need to request approval. You need to click on this step, okay, and need to fill up this form real quick. You know, just uh, do what's what's true here. No, no special, uh, special, uh, you know, special thing you need to know about it. Just fill fill up this form. They're immediately going to to uh, to approve you. No need to be any problem. Okay. So um, what about um, the part where it says company website? Okay, about company website. It's like it's a yeah, it's mandatory, but you can just uh, write, uh, you know, uh, you can buy a domain, you know, uh, just, uh, I'm sure you have any domain and you can just put your domain in. They're not really looking at your domain. Uh, just to be honest, you know, they're never looked at my domain. So you probably not need to. Oh, you, you check your analytics? Uh, what do you mean about check my analytics? 
Oh, just to see if uh, somebody from Amazon actually looked at your... Uh, no, no. I, I didn't look at it, but you know, I know that no one looking at my domain because it was only a domain. No website inside, nothing. Just that's how I started when I uh, uh, requested my first uh, uh, my first approval to Amazon. I just put it my domain, the domain that I bought. I didn't have any any <laughs> hosting account. Hosting. Yeah, no hosting, okay. nothing. You know, just put my domain in. I didn't knew nothing back then, so I just put my domain. You know, I bought a domain and I thought, wow, I have a website, and <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. just to be honest. That was happening and they just approved me and if you have any issues i i truly uh, uh, advise you to just call them and tell them that you you are just starting and you don't have any website uh, you just want to approve no need to be any problem with that okay 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 so it will take them about 24 hours to approve you maximum five days you know no more than five days by friday you're supposed to have your uh, your uh, category approval and then you'll need to do the following okay you need to go to add a product okay and uh, create a new product and here you need to write your first product niche which is uh, sewing kit okay and here I can see two things that uh, kind of blink into me uh, first of all is sewing tool and repair kit and the second thing is sewing kit you know now if I didn't have anything to you know kind of uh, check myself but I do want to check myself to see what fits most to my product and if it's repair kits or only sewing kit so let me see okay I'll just go back to my products and you see sewing project kits Okay, let's go here. Sewing product kits. You see, everyone here is uh, under sewing product project sewing baskets. You see, guys, can you see what I'm doing? Yeah. Yeah. And here is sewing baskets. Okay, so it's supposed to be sewing project kits. Uh, so let's just go here. You know. And here, you know, I, will, I, 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 I won't be able to find the sewing project kits. Okay, sometimes Amazon is concealing that. And I'm not sure why they are doing that. But in that case, I will just pick the shorter keyword. You know, you see here sewing tools and repair kits. And I see sewing kits. I'll just pick yep. the shorter one, you know, the shorter category. Okay. Okay. Be because both of them are correct, but this one is more broad. Okay. So I'll just uh -huh. pick sewing kit. Okay. And once yeah. I pick my sewing kit, I need to put my product name, manufacturer, and everything. Let me show you now how it's working. So, first of all, my product name is. Uh, uh, let's write. Okay. So. So let me just talk to you a little about product name. So what is important to put on your product name? That's actually your product title. And you can actually look at your competitors and see what titles they are using. So you see best sewing kit. Let, let, me, let me show you a few elements that is really, really important to contain on your uh, title, okay? First of all, you need you need to go to Amazon. Uh, sorry, it's uh, it's Google Google Keywords tool. You know who know Google Keywords tool? Yes. Okay. Keyword planner. Keyword planner. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I actually using uh, Market Samurai, but I I'm not sure that you guys had Market Samurai. Uh, this is making my work much easier uh, but I, I'll just show you how to do it with uh, Google <coughs> keywords tool so get traffic estimated list of keywords so I'll just write sewing <coughs> kit okay 
and <clears throat> and I'll go to merchant keywords no merchant keyword yep. keywords okay <clears throat> and I'll just type here again sewing kit and let me tell you why first of all I would like to I need to sort it from the highest to the lowest okay <clears throat> and I want these keywords okay the highest rank keyword okay you see them you see what I'm doing yep so in case <clears throat> So Ori, you check all the different tools just to see, make sure you're not missing anything. I'm sorry? Do you check using all the different tools to make sure you're not missing out on keywords? Yeah, uh, no, no, actually not all the different tools. Sorry, I'm, <clears throat> I'm, I'm, I'm only using actually uh, Market Samurai, but uh, I'll just show you how to do it manually. Market Samurai is doing it much better, but uh, right. since you guys don't have Market Market Samurai, I'm sorry. Uh, then I'll just show you I how to do. It. Oh, do you have a Market Samurai? Yeah, I've got it. Yes. Okay, so you can just do it uh, through Market Samurai, which will help you a lot and save you like uh, a lot of time. Okay. Uh, I'll show you also how to do it on uh, Market Samurai. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I don't know what happened. I'm just, uh, I'm not sure how to say this in English, but when you're all the time like, <gasps> you know this? Hiccups. <laughs> uh, uh, Hiccups. Uh, yeah. Somebody uh, needs to scare you already, so uh -huh. stop. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I, I know how to sort that. Yeah, do you have any any idea? Yeah, you need to. You breathe inside a plastic bag. Uh, no, <laughs> you just need to take a deep, full breath, and breathe through. I mean, use your stomach and breathe, and hold it there for a few seconds. Okay, I think it's helping. I just did that. Okay. okay thank you. Yeah, and it should go away. Okay, uh, I'll just continue. It's not uh, that hard, <laughs> but. <laughs> I'm sorry. I I hope you can forgive me. No, yeah. Okay. okay. No problem. And then you need to go to keyword. Oh, sorry. Uh, I uh, I'm sorry. You need to go back. Uh, I just made a mistake. I didn't go to keywords I idea. I supposed to to go here to to keywords idea. No worries. Uh. multiple keywords idea okay okay I'm just taking my highest <coughs> uh, my highest ranked keyword okay what that's what I'm going to do okay and here I'm going to pick only United States that's okay oops I'm not sure what's happening with this, with this tool. It's uh, we just I I I haven't for use it for a long time. You know it it's kind of changed. <coughs> uh, just go back or to the search. If you can go back to the first one, I think you have to click the top search. Okay, let me take a look. I think I think that's just for advertising what you're doing is for pay per click or something. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. So you go um, keywords too. Keywords. Uh, um, well, actually, yeah, the, they changed their interface. So if you if you just uh, if you type to Google keyword tool, you're gonna see the same thing actually. Okay, so let me just start well, over. What are, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to get the oh. search volumes or? Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm you just type it in there. Yep, 
This yeah. should work. Okay. This should work. I just did it before. Let me let yeah, me get just... idea and get the yeah. idea. Okay, that's great. That's great. Okay, so I see at all eight oh oh five. You see eight oh five keywords here. So I can just uh, sorry. Let me just see. Why can't I see all the keywords? You know. Oh, sewing kit. Let's just see. Okay, I see that sewing kit has the most searched. And um, I'm not sure where where is all the keywords here. You know, I know how to do it from Market Samurai. It's really easy. <coughs> uh, you so you're trying to get the related keywords, right? Y yeah, exactly. That's what what I'm trying okay, to say. Okay, so uh, at the top, um, click on Modify Search. Okay. Modify Search. Yeah. Um. Uh, hold on, search for new keywords. Yeah, you know what? Uh, Stop it. Volume for a list of keywords. Yeah, you chose the first one, right? Yeah, that's what I chose before. You know. Yeah, that was the uh, that was the correct selection. So I'm not sure why you didn't see the, re yeah, the not, uh, related keywords. I'm not sure why neither. But oh, okay, I think. I think that that's it, but I need to get estimation about, you know what, let me just show it to, to you from Market Samurai, and uh, I, I really don't, you know, I'm not using, uh, uh, I'm not using this product, but you can uh, later on ask from, you know, if if you have my Market Samurai, then you, then you can just ask your friend or someone who can uh, who is, can do that for you you know i'll just show you how to do it on market samurai it's really easy it's sewing kit you know that's what i'm doing on market samurai and the same title here i'm just uh choosing united states they're doing all the all the work for me all the heavy lifting <coughs> so i'll just uh, click create and keyword research and I'm adding new keyword. Uh, you know what? I'll, I just want to add more, new, more key, keywords since sewing kit is the is the best keyword here. You know, it's the the it's biggest the seed one, isn't it? Yeah, it's the seed keyword. I'm, again, I'm sorry. I <laughs> warm water. Yeah, I, I need I need to do something like this. I know. Yeah, let's try my method. Okay. <laughs> you got multiple options, sorry. Yeah. Just you got <laughs> many choices to try. Yeah. Let me just try to take a deep breath and hold it for a second until it will finish the fetching. Hey, Ori, I was just curious about the keywords that you choose. It's important that they need to be related to your exact product, isn't it? Even yeah. though the high high search volume it could say something uh, around your product but if it's not exactly the product that you're after do you, you you shouldn't use it no I'm just filtering them manually but, but let me show you what what's happening you know now I'm going to keyword analysis and just I'm analyzing my keywords I can actually uh, uh, do it for you if you have any troubles you know to find someone who can do this for you and give you the export at Excel now I'll just export the Excel later on and show you how it's working. Uh, <clears throat> I actually, you know, I'm I'm just trying to see the traffic, and I'm I I'm going to take the the most searched traffic for this keyword. You know, that's what I'm going to do. Let me show you. Okay. Oh, I don't need the challenge. I just need no filter here. You know, I just need analyze keyword with no filter. Okay. And in the meantime, I advise you to go to Amazon like this and just do do uh, this 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 type of thing. You see, type sewing kit and then do uh, backspace and then look if there are more uh, related keyword like, like sewing kit mini. You see, it's search keyword. It's hot ter term, so you can copy it. 
so it's mini it's another keyword you see and uh, travel mini uh, for beginners box it's okay all of these are relevant keywords you should use them okay <coughs> you should use them on your title okay because all of okay. these are people that people their people are are searching for okay you see suing kit suing kit for adults suing kit for kids suing kit travel suing kit you see travel suing kit that's another keyword oh. sorry yeah sorry sorry to interrupt i just i can't see your screen it's still a market samurai but um, based on what you're saying, are we just typing in the main keyword and then doing ABC? ABC, like exact. Okay. Exactly. Okay, got you got my point. And 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 uh, once you did it, uh, let me just export the keyword. Can you see my screen moving? I'm I'm on Market Samurai right now. Yes. Okay. So uh, let me just take the keyword analysis here. And let me just uh, filter it by SEO traffic, okay? So I'll just filter it from top to bottom. From, you see? So what I, I can do right now is uh, I can filter them manually. You know, like uh, uh, filter them manually. And I can also... Wow, there is a lot of background noises. And I can also use these keywords and, and see their search volume. Because Suing Kit is one of the keywords. Then I'll just take it here. Let's see what more keywords. Uh, Suing Kit Travel. Let's just write Suing Kit Travel here. Sorry. Suing Kit Travel. Oops. Suing kit, travel, and then travel suing kit. Okay, and another thing is, uh, let me just uh, beginner. You see the word suing kit for beginner, suing kit beginner, uh, suing kit for beginners. You see, this guy really know what he's doing. Why know what he's doing? Because. Uh, you see the word beginners? Yeah. Yeah, this guy know what he's doing. That's why he uses the same method like I do. You see beginners, it's the exact same keyword, suing kit for beginners. So you should just use the, the keyword beginners on your uh, uh, beginners. Or, I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Yes. Yeah. I'm curious. This is a method they taught you in AECM, isn't it? Uh, strategy. Yeah. Okay. Because you, you probably heard the E Formula guy suggesting they prefer shorter titles, so it looks a bit more tidier and professional. But if, yeah. If you do it shorter, you're going to miss out on the traffic, aren't you? Yeah. Keywords. Yeah, you will probably lose. But I will give you another tip: how to save space. And how how to to make it more relevant with less space, okay? okay. I will teach you a, a quick method that I know of, okay? Cool. So let's just keep gathering some keywords, okay? So let me just go here to Amazon. <coughs> <coughs> so uh, again, sewing kit. Let me see what more. Mini. The word mini. The word box. The word uh, girls. Okay, let's just add this keyword. Sorry. Uh, mini. Girls. Box. I'll teach you later on why, I, why I'm just don't writing the full keyword. I'm just writing the, the missing keywords. Uh, perfect. You know, let me just... Uh, kids. You see kids. Kids. Uh, let's see what what more litter litter you see yeah. uh, litter. litter okay uh, mini kids doing kids uh, box girls 
kid, kid, adults, adults, adults. Okay. Uh, what more? Sewing kit, sewing supplies, supplies. You see supplies, supplies. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure if patterns is the right keyword, but uh, let's just write K. Kit for kids, travel sewing kids, kit for girls. Uh, mini sewing kit box, litter. Uh, let, let's see what more keywords this guy is using. Girls and boys. What about you see? emergency? I'm sorry? What about emergency? Emergency, yeah. Emergency sewing. Let's see. Emergency sewing kits. You're right. You made emergency sewing. Right. That's emergency. Okay, let's use it. Uh, what more? In what more? If I'll just use the emergency survival kit, sewing kit. Okay, let's see what more keywords. Let's go to uh, Google and let's just write sewing kit here. Sewing kit. And let's see what more keywords that people are looking for. You see here below sewing box, sewing tools, sewing uh, kits doesn't thrive. I don't know what is thrive. What is thrive? Stuff. I think that's a game. Oh, okay. Sewing kit list, content, Walmart. Essentials, essentials. That's that's great. Now essentials. You can use it. Uh, let's go for emergency. The word emergency, and let's use the. Let's see more. Let's get more idea from here. I'm not sure what is the embroidery tree. I'm not sure what is this. Embroidery. Yeah, emb embroidery. It's the type of sewing that you do, I think. Okay, I'm not sure. Like make a make a pattern, you know, or oh. something. Okay, I'm not sure that's the the, the right thing for us. Uh, antique. Let's see. Let's see. Beginners. Okay, beginners. We take it already. Sewing kit. Sewing kit for kids. Kids. Uh, oh. Kids. I think we took the word kids, right? Kids. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, baby quite kit now, baby fabric now, antique now, whole sewing, all, the word all. We do want to take the word all, all sewing, all sewing. Uh, toys, let's, let's see if all sewing is, uh, is, is good for us. All. Okay, all sewing machine, all sewing Emily now. Okay, so sewing kit, sewing table, sewing pattern, basket. You know, okay, read. Okay, that that's enough. You know, that's enough for our title. We gather enough. I sometimes uh, I like to to take all these keywords my main keywords you know put it at the beginning like uh, here you know like put it at the beginning and just take and see what's the uh, what's the search volume on uh, merchant keywords okay just to get an idea how much this product is going to make but uh, right now it's not so uh, you know it's not so crucial because that's the 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 I'm sure that the, the gr a great a great keyword, okay? Okay, uh, sewing kit essential, essentials. Okay, and all sewing. Okay, so that's the keywords that we need to use on our title. So, right now, what's the next step? The next step is we, we're still on add product, remember? Here. So, all we need to do is go to char character, character count to let me just type this on your uh, search bar here and you can take this 
uh, website. Oops. I'm not sure Just why. Just out of curiosity, how many characters does Amazon allow in your title? 253 or 263, I'm not sure. Okay. Okay, uh, this website was crashed. Um, let's just let's find another another tool. Okay, let's just use this tool. Okay. And uh, what I advise you to do is just try to format a great selling a, a title from the keywords that you got you know you got all these keywords okay and you can maximum do two five three but try to use every keyword one for example the word suing try to use it one kit travel kit try to use kit one you know so let me just delete all the kits okay okay you just need to use this keyword at this, this keyword one suing you don't need suing suing just once use it just once okay you can you can use it more than once but you just uh wasting space okay uh, yeah, yeah okay you can use the plural also, also the plural kits suing kits okay yeah suing Essentials, all suing. Okay, that that's it. You know, you can uh, suing kit, emergency. Suing kits is a, it's a full keyword, so you can use it as as a full. But all the word all. Okay, so try to format a, a compelling uh, title from this keyword, from all these keywords. You know why? Because this is the most uh, essential essential keywords. And, and you have all already 134 characters okay try to use as many keywords as possible so if for example you can you can uh, you need more keywords like for example best you can use the word best that's best suing suing kit for for travel for travel uh, uh, you know, you can use brand name, your brand name at the beginning. Okay, you can use the star okay. here, yep. just put the star, the star mark. Okay, brand name, star best suing kit for travel. Uh, mini, you know, like mini. Now, you can use the dash and use the word mini kit you know for boys for kids kids is better kids and girls okay and girls um uh isental you know you can use the word like take isental uh supplies no just try to do your best uh for uh for uh, emergency no emergency uh uh leader i'm not i don't i'm not sure made of made of leader. uh lucrative you know you you got the point uh, yeah. made of a uh, lucrative leader uh, high quality lucrative high quality high quality it never hurts to 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 add more and now I advise you to to search for more uh, uh, leader you know you can do like uh, adult style you know like adult style okay you can use the, the uh, and and just try to get to two five three qh two five three okay two five three okay and and after you made you made it let me just put it for you Yvonne so you can use it yeah. you know 
it's, it's a small research, but you can do much better research than I do, you know, and here you can find more keywords on the sewing kit analysis, you know, I just made here, let me just send it to you also, so you can uh, use it, Yvonne, thank you. you can, you can download it, uh, yeah, thank you so much, okay, no problem, and, uh, you know, now try to take more keywords, oh, I'm not sure why it's not loading, it just, uh, okay, I think it was stuck, okay um, uh, oh my god okay I'm not sure why it's not opening that again uh, maybe my computer was stuck I'm not sure why but never mind okay you got my point then you need to add more character you know more keywords relevant keywords to uh, to to this uh, to this uh, uh, character count tool for every place you just can okay from anywhere you just can if you can use the word baby because baby is using or pattern nice for doing patterns and stuff like this you know you can uh, okay nice nice for doing i don't know patterns I, i'm not i i'm not really sure of what i'm telling to you right now but let's just say that this is our description and at the at the end please end add something like uh, um, uh, your money back guarantee your money back guarantee okay uh one okay or or uh, uh uh, full satisfaction full satisfaction or your money back guarantee uh, something like this okay try okay. To, to do it like this and uh, add like uh, I don't know maybe if you have like more characters than you need you see we almost get it okay so all you need to do is just take this and put it here and here you can put your uh, and just ignore this part okay because uh, it's not really makes uh, our here. Sorry. It's okay. Here, here they are asking you to to put the capital letters. So let's just change them all. You know, like capital letters. It's really nice. Sure. And for the manufacturer, you just putting your brand name. Brand name. Okay. Uh okay and for the brand name you're putting your brand name again okay because you are want to be the manufacturer so yeah. say okay now try to fill here the the you know, quantity don't feel nothing but the model number you can just you can just do sewing 99 for example you can just put something like this for the color depends on the color the size you need to put the size um everything you can just fill in from this uh from this uh, information don't have to fill it 100 percent. just do it okay so let me just give you right now uh my uh, uh wait a second okay let me just give you uh, your uh, uh, barcodes that I promised you. Okay. Okay. So, guys, uh, okay, so all of these barcodes are my barcode. Uh, so, uh, please don't use it because you just saw it because i'm going to sue anyone i'm going to use this barcode without my permission the last four is yours okay you can use them uh but all the rest are are uh, you know legally bought by me okay so just use uh what i'm going to to give you sure okay so this is the barcode and uh let me just uh, give it away uh franklin the first one is yours. Yes. Okay. Uh, Shuan, okay. 
Chuan, this one is yours yes. with 710. Uh, okay, thank you. Yeah, no problem. Uh, Yvonne, sorry, wait a sec. Okay, this one is yours, 727. Okay. Uh, Martin, this one is yours, is yours, 734. Okay, thank you. No problem. Okay, so all of us have uh, one, two, three, four. You know, let me see how much I copied. One, two, I'm not sure how many, but one, two. What, what about three, the one four. for Edgar? Edgar, yeah. Let me just copy another one. This is a nine seven. Okay, so this one for Edgar, you can give it to Edgar. Okay, and uh, this one is actually going <coughs> here, you see, for this one, for example, I'll just take it. Uh, as for our trial, just to show you, you know, how, how things are, are working. And you're supposed to uh, paste this UNI or barcode here, okay? You, you're supposed okay. To, to put this barcode here. And I'm just going to spend this barcode right now. It's going to be spended, but it's okay. You know, it's for a good purpose. And then you click next, okay? Now, condition is always new. Your price... You can set, you know, it's not, you know, it's not mandatory. It's mandatory for now, and it's always later. So let's just put here 25, for example. Uh, seller SKU, uh, you don't have a seller SKU. You can just leave it blank. Co tax code, uh, you don't need tax code since, since you're not living in the U.S. But, you know, I'm not the one who's giving you any any advice about tax code so you you can consult someone who is no better than i do okay handling time in days you don't have anything you don't have to use anything from here okay since this one is is uh, uh use use using later by, by amazon and now the images okay as for the images you know you can leave it without images uh, as for now but i strongly advise you to add the uh, the supplier images at the beginning, you know, the, the images that it took for you, uh, your special image that it took for you, you can just need to click on add images and add these images, like browse them and upload them. Now you don't have to ask them for really nice images, but just until you, you take it to a professional that will do something uh, better with them, okay? Okay. Okay. okay, it's really important. Just upload some images. Just something that, the, 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 if, you, if you know a little Photoshop, just try to do background for them. Ask for the supplier to take it from all sizes. You know, just push him a little to do better images, but, you know, don't push him too hard, okay? Okay, and if you know a little Photoshop, take it to Fiverr, pay five bucks, and just make it with back, white background, okay? Uh, descriptions product key features take always only from merchant keywords you know professional sewing kit sewing kit uh, singer sewing kit brother sewing kit Alex sewing kit take from you know the best of uh, just take it from here okay okay uh, I always advise you to take because that's the best keywords the people are the most looking for okay oh sorry it's not the product feature for the product feature you need you need to write compelling description of benefits and let me show you one thing that you need to take into account for example you see hose nozzle let me just take i always like to take the hose nozzle and for example if you see here the hose nozzle and you see my my title here then you should see the product feature here you see only the first line you see the first uh, line yeah, yeah. okay so that's the first line that you're going to write here. So try to make it really compelling. So people is going to buy from you. You know, don't just write a crappy first uh, uh, product feature. You know, you need to write the first one that's going to yep. be really the best, okay? okay? You can gather more idea from your, competitor, from your, your com competitors, but your first line need to be like high rocking, you know, like, wow, okay? Something that people who is reading that is going to, you know, say wow. multifunctional fire hose nozzle and garden hose spray to one year guarantee. Wow, that's great. Instead of, uh, I don't know, let's say 
okay free shipping order over 35 dollar you know not so it's convincing the same, yeah. yeah or 300 more water floor that's good that's good yeah. or uh, i don't know let's see free free you see that's that's the standard since he didn't uh, fill it fill up anything free shipping you see and and it's actually not correct because it's not really free shipping amazon is charging them uh, uh, sorry it's a uh, water flow in it fits all standard garden hoses i'm not sure how good it is okay um, let's do you know four large opening at nozzle tip full flow you know you just need to do it more compelling okay that's one more tip you should take into account okay yeah. and uh, product description okay now about the product description uh, do you know the the, the, the the tool that the e-formula guys is giving you? Uh, I will attach you uh, one more uh, uh, video uh, of Matt Clark, you know, uh, of how, to, uh, how to, to create compelling product description. I will upload it um, to YouTube, but I'm going to put your emails uh, because it's not going to be you know like it's violation of uh, of the right so i'll just upload for your for your own eyes only okay okay thank you okay. so so just uh, use this uh, don't spread it to anyone don't spread it on facebook or anything you know it's uh, it's copyrighted uh, video okay okay i'm going to take it from asm and just give it to you so we will teach you how to do that uh keywords and everything just put it the best of your effort you know uh you know you don't platinum merchant so you don't need to do that but everything you can just put it just put it okay and more details you know everything you can especially the product dimension okay let's say the product dimension is five on five on five okay and always put inches in okay and uh everything here try to uh, fill it the best as you can okay yeah. okay so after you 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 did it just try to save and finish uh, well, not finish huh? uh, try, try to put it on save and finish and once you're done okay you see this the brand name best doing kids travel blah 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 one year guarantee okay and let me check, take a look at it. Uh, or do, do we have to be really accurate about the uh, product dimensions, packaging dimensions and the weight? Yeah, try to be, yeah. yeah. Try to be as accurate as possible. Okay, so actually... I guess, I guess the best numbers uh, we can get from the supplier, I guess? Uh, yeah, yeah. You can just need to trust the supplier, but if you got the sample you can just take the sample and measure it you know like uh, uh take a home measurement uh to Sorry? yeah right uh does amazon you know the in fba calculators there's this uh this text that say uh weight handling fee okay yeah uh, so does Amazon uh, measure your weigh your product uh, and then charge you accordingly or if not then you can just specify a fake weight right no specify, no right, don't right. don't do that because you're going to get into Amazon investigation after you're going to sell like about 500 pieces Amazon is going to put investigation on your product and uh, if if there will probably uh, see some really really uh, not correct uh, values then they will probably uh, stop your product to be sell uh, until they will uh, end the, their uh, 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 their checkout and then your product is not going to be sold for about seven days if your uh, listing is not correct so I'm not advising you to do that okay, okay. if it's small minor stuff then you can just uh, uh, do that okay so um you see 
they're telling me that I put I must put price and more information that I forgot so let me just edit the details again so the price here you see the quantity it's 100 and let me see what more essential information I do need to fill in I maybe I might uh, I might forgot some vital information okay uh, Okay, I think everything is great. Let me just save and finish. Okay, you can always go back and change that. But, okay, let me just show you. Sewing kit. Okay, you see here, that's the product. Okay. Guys, can you all see that? Yep. Okay. Yeah, so, so the next thing you need to do is just go into action and just change it to fulfilled by Amazon. Okay fulfilled by Amazon and just click on convert only not convert and send inventory because your inventory is not yet on Jim's place just click on convert only okay and it will take about 15 minutes uh, let me just and and that's it you know it will uh, that's a display is no more okay it will take about you need to go to manage inventory again you see that this one is still sold by merchant and it will change in about 15 minutes to sold by Amazon Okay, that's what I just did right now. Amazon is just uh, uh, doing some stuff and, and uh, it will take some time for it to update. And now the, the most important part is you need to scrape your barcode from this product. So what is your barcode? That's the, the, the thing that you need to do. Okay, so you need to go here to click on action. And uh, okay, you still can't do a barcode, but in 15 minutes, it will going to change to Amazon. Okay, let me show you on this product how you how you can scrape your barcode. You will just need to click on this and click on um, print item labels. You see, after 15 minutes, it's going to be available here. Okay, guys, can you see that? Yep. Yes. Okay. Now, after you did it on print uh, print item labels, you just need to print the item label. Okay and print only one you need to click uh, do uh, approval and you can just download this uh, this uh, uh, barcode that's the barcode that you need to put on your design but it's really important that this barcode is going to be vector based uh, barcode you know not like an image that you're giving them you know not like a print screen give them the PDF to the supplier or to your designer because if it's going to, cha to be changed to an image, then the quality of the barcode is going to be screwed. I'm not sure if you're familiar with vector-based design and uh, image-based design. Let me show you what happened. Now let me just show you uh, firsthand what happened. Okay. Well, the difference is that if, uh, if you have a vector, then no matter how big you... Uh, the uh, size yeah it's still gonna look good right? exactly and it's important because you want your barcode to be readable okay you really want your barcode to be readable and if it's if you're not sending the your designer the vector base let's say you just took a print screen of your barcode here you see and just uh, gave it to your uh, uh, designer like this okay so let's just do it right here and let me show you what's happening. So let's say I'll just scrape this. No, I'll just scrape this. Okay. And see what's happening when I'm getting close. You see what happened to the barcode? This is image. This is image. It's not good. What happened? And if you're going to do it like this and send it to the supplier, then uh, it's going to screw. It's like you didn't do nothing. You know, it's a small tip I'm giving you. It's like you didn't do nothing and your barcode is not going to be readable for the barcode scanner okay so if I'll just do the same just I'll do it like this let me show you for example what I'm going to do I'm going to take it like this and uh, for example um, I'll just take the barcode from here and scrape it into uh, Photoshop let me just find Photoshop okay okay 
Now I have like a. Okay, you know that's that's the difference. You you just need to send them the PDF, uh, and and I'm strongly advise you to, uh, because I, I I did it once and I made a big huge mistake, and I, all of the barcode that the supplier did for me were not good. Then Amazon charged me a lot of fee to fix them. You see, this is this is not good. Okay, you just need to put it uh, vector based. Okay, guys. I hope that makes sense. So basically, we just send them the PDF. PDF right? Yeah, but one more thing I suggest you to do is uh, you can download the cracked version of Infix. Do you know Infix? Uh, you can uh, you can find it on uh, I don't know maybe CatPH. No, do you know CatPH, guys? No. Uh, uTorrent. Do you know uTorrent? Yes. Okay, yeah. yeah, just uh, download uTorrent on your, on your computer and go to cat.ph, it's kickass2, okay, and write infix and you can uh, take the cracked version of infix and let me show you what it's doing, you can just download this one, okay, oh. yeah, and open and everything, <laughs> okay, yeah. it's cracked version and I strongly advise you to download it and let me show you what it's doing, uh, let's take the infix. So I'll just go here and I'll take the PDF. Uh, let's take the PDF to Infix. Okay, so let me just add Made in China here, you know, because you don't want the supplier to add another. You know, I can also add this uh, text and everything, you know, I can delete and do whatever I want. That's what uh, nice with Infix, okay, first of all. And second thing, so I can use Made in China. Made in China. It's really important to do that, okay? okay. It's, uh, it's by the law, so I just advise you to do that, okay? It's, uh, it's the U.S. law, okay? So just take the Made in China. You can, uh, you know, put it like this smaller and put it right here and give it to the supplier so the supplier can put your barcode like this and you can save it as PDF again file save as let's just save it on my desktop again and uh, let's call it barcode suing okay and uh, now you can see see it again and it's still vector based you see it's suing and it's vector -based. Do you normally tell your designer uh, um, how much resolution you want for the labels and the packaging and all that uh, yeah it's the same size it's like 100 percent don't minimize it and don't uh, don't don't enlarge it and not this big, make it smaller you know but, uh, i mean what about the print resolution like uh are you familiar with the term dpi yeah Not per inch yeah yeah that use the highest dpi possible but if you're giving them an image, then you will probably screw it. You know, no, no matter what DPI you're going to use, it's going to yeah. screw it. Just give them the uh, PDF, okay? okay? Okay, that's one more tip and very important one. Okay, so, so this one you should give to the guy on Fiverr, tell him to, to uh, just paste it on your design. Uh, let's say, for example, let me show you. You see, what I just did is uh, I. This is just an image, but you see, uh, it's 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 actually an image. It's not a, it's not a real product, but but uh, it's supposed to be. Let me show you this one on PDF. Maybe. Okay, you see, this one is on with PDF, and now no matter how what how much I'm I'm closing, you know, it's still preserved the you see it still preserves the resolution you see that's pdf okay and that's how i advise you to put the the design you know it's five dollar design nothing fancy but but i hope the dots are getting connected to you okay yeah okay so um, can you also can you um also show us how to generate the uh 
the shipping labels or the, no the, the packing slips I guess yeah I can but you know um, let me show you you know you, you first of all need the product to get to gym before you're doing the packing slip so packing slip costs money you know to 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 create so I'll just show you how to do that once I'll get one of my product uh, to Amazon I'll just uh, arrange a call with you guys and show you how I'll do it on my product okay, okay. so I'll just do it uh, on kind of Friday maybe I will show you how I do it for one of my products that I'm getting to Amazon once I have product that I'm getting from Jim then I'll show you uh, real time how I'm uh, how I'm actually taking a product and create packing slip for it and how I'm calculating the cost from Jim's place to Amazon Okay. Sure. Um, I, just wondering if, uh, let's say, let's say we are shipping so many products such that the supplier uh, separates the pro products into, let's say, five different cartons. So, do you know if, this, if a supplier would normally put the uh, five cartons into one huge box, or no? The they send the boxes separately. The maximum you can put inside each box is 125. So you should ask your supplier to arrange it in 125 maximum uh, products per carton. You know, that's the maximum you can put one, two, three, four, five, you know, but maximum 125 in each carton. Okay? Oh, that's, uh, uh, that's a requirement by Amazon? Yeah, that's requirement by Amazon. That's the best okay, you can put. So now, if there are like five cartons, um, what's going to happen then? Will, will the uh, five cartons be shipped separately by the uh, suppliers, like yeah. individually? Yeah, they're just going to send to Jim the, the cartons. Uh, one more thing before before I answer you this question, I just want to finish the, the all the, the creating the barcodes, uh, creating listing. You know, there is two types of listing listing individual and listing with which is multiple listing let's say for example you see the plus sign that means that's a multiple listing for example uh, my car sunshade is multiple listing let me show you you see this one is multiple listing you see i have options to 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 choose from from it you see yes different sizes different yes. sizes yeah that's the other type but that's uh, I'm not going to teach you right now. I'm just learn uh, teach you the touch you the basics because none of you is like getting like uh, more than one size for its product and everything. Uh, and uh, you can always ask Amazon support, you know, just to teach you how to how to do this uh, stuff. Okay, but it's it's much more complicated than creating uh, uh, one product uh, size. Okay. Uh, one product uh, like I just show you okay so about your question uh, Franklin um, yeah. uh, just tell the supplier to send it to, uh, to Jim's place N you know no more than 125 in each carton okay Jim's okay. know what to do I'll, I'll just show you later on how to create labels and how to print them let me show you how labels uh, supposed to look like when you're sending them to Jim you know let me just uh, uh, show you. So one one slip goes inside the carton, and the other one goes outside, right? Uh, the, I the think ads. it's only I think it's only outside. Inside uh, there is no need anymore. But Jim knows exactly what to do. Okay. Uh, okay. So don't don't too much worry about it. Uh, let me just. Uh, okay oh for example you see here that's invoices that i'm getting from jim you know people that caught me in the in the costumes and uh asked, asked me to pay so jim just sending me print screen of the invoices and i'm just paying him via paypal you know that's for example the costumes didn't cut me but he sent to jim the the bill so jim jim was sending that to me okay that's an example yeah I was just about to ask uh, about the custom. Okay. Uh, yeah, I understand that if your goods is more than two thousand five hundred dollars, you have to engage a custom broker, right? 
Uh, yeah, but that's if you're shipping it by sea and not by air. By sea. Oh, by air, so you don't need. Yeah, so you don't need that. Yeah. No, that's good. Uh, so here is, for example, an email that Jim sent me. He sent me 16 cases of 18 units. So for each line here, for each three lines, I'm creating packing slip. So let me show you the 16 cases of 18 units, how it looks like when I'm sending him the packing slip. So it looks like this. Uh, see, that's how the packing slip looks like. And it just uh, putting it on the, it, it's automatic generated. Uh, in it. Okay, that's the pink dot, 16 cases of 18 units. See, it's exactly how he sent it to me. That's the pink right. bathroom tot, okay? It's 16 cases of 18 units. So I just send him this packing slip. And let me show you how it looks like. I, I'll, I'll teach you how to generate it once your product getting to gym. Uh, or maybe on Saturday or, or, Monday, or Monday or whatever you uh, are going to be our next... Uh, you see, I have 16... Sunday, Sunday yeah, sorry. Uh, I have 16 pages. And every page I have different packing slip, okay? Everyone uh, equals one box, okay? Oh, okay. Okay. So, guys, I really have to go now. My wife is kind of... Uh, yep. thank, <laughs> thank you very much for all your time. Oh, Sorry, Tia, one last question. Um, you, you said that you always pay uh, DDP, right? How come you, Jim, uh, uh, how come the U.S. Customs still uh, charge you? Uh, duties and taxes you know i'm using sometimes ddp sometimes ddu i'm just trying my luck you know <laughs> when, ah, okay, uh, when when uh, when i'm trying my luck sometimes the costume cut me catching me and you know like I'm, i need to pay to gym you know? but it's okay you know how much is 17 dollars seven zero <clears throat> you know it's not nothing that like that uh uh drop me for my feet you know it's not it's not too much money Okay. Yeah. And you, you pay Jim via PayPal, right? Yeah, I'm just paying him what he deserves you know, because he, he really deserves that. Okay. okay, guys? All right, then. Uh, so, uh, uh, enjoy, your, enjoy your party. It, thank you. It's uh, actually a friend's party. Uh, thank you, Okay, guys. Thank you. So, Thanks again, Thanks, Ari. No, no Have problem. Uh, uh, next. <laughs> next Thanks for time. No problem. Next, next uh, session is going to be uh, Friday or Monday? Or uh, Sunday, uh, sorry. Su Sunday, I guess. Sunday, Sunday, great. Okay, so see you on Sunday. Catch yeah. up later. So bye. you're gonna upload. Yeah. Bye, guys. Video later today, right? uh, I'll send it to you guys. Bye, bye. Bye. Okay. Bye, bye. Bye. See you, bye. Right. See you guys. Bye, bye. Thanks. Bye. See you.